Maybe it's the new man in her life, or maybe uh, all the pineapple has gone to her head. But Teresa finally apologized to Jackie a few weeks ago, and I don't want to jinx it. It seems like they're kind of in a good place now. But I'm curious to know if Jackie thinks anything she's done as a housewife is worthy of some atonement. We're going to find out with apology or not from me. Okay, Jackie, should you apologize to Teresa for asking her if she got her confidence in jail? No, she was pounding me that night. She was asking for it. Should you apologize to Evan for speaking so openly about the lack of oral sex in your marriage? Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe I should. It's a little embarrassing for him. Or maybe you should just blow him. <laughs> maybe. Should you apologize? That would be his preferred alternative. Yeah, I'm sure. Should you apologize to Jennifer for writing an article about the impact of spoiling children and a clear reference to her? <laughs> no, because I said that her children are wonderful and not spoiled. Should you apologize to Margaret for telling her that her husband's an asshole? Yes, okay. because I think that set her off. I think I could have spoken a little more gently about it. Should you apologize to Teresa for saying she should stick her olive branch up her ass? No, because that was not an olive branch. Putting me on a group text after you spread a rumor that my husband was cheating is not an olive branch. All right. <laughs> no. Listen. Oh, but those curtain bangs. I should apologize to the world for those curtain bangs. <laughs> Brad agrees. Should you apologize for serving pizza and handing out party favors from a big box at your son's birthday no, party? No, that's the best kind of party. A driveway, some basketball, pizza. Yeah, we all know I got money. I don't have to blow it in everyone's face, right? The audience is giving you thumbs down. Should you apologize to Dolores for taking such offense to her comments about your upbringing last season? No, I think that's very offensive. She was not there when I was growing up, so she doesn't know anything about my upbringing. Should you apologize to your guests at Evan's second birthday party for telling them so many times to tell Evan they know he didn't cheat? That yes, seemed a little wild. You kept saying you wanted to start fresh and then you kept bringing it up. I know because I knew that they had just spent four days in Lake George talking about it and I didn't have a voice in that conversation. So this was my one shot to make sure everyone knew and to make sure Evan felt comfortable and knew his friends supported him. And I think I went a little overboard. All right, there you go. I do too. Okay, thank you very much, Jack. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.